what's going on everybody here welcome back to some more hygieneer so last episode uh we got some more miners installed and we got some logic going because we got switches switches are wonderful right absolutely now this episode i want to go ahead and i want to start working on getting this giant chunk right here kind of cleared out and kind of figuring out how we're going to have the layout of everything going forward because i think we're going to have another set of miners in here we're, we're gonna play with this because like i said i think what tier two is considered up to like right here is where we can no longer place them so i think tier two is considered up to here so we're gonna keep all this like you know ready to go for uh for another set of machines but we also have to keep in mind that once tier three comes out i don't know how long that's gonna be but once tier three comes out we're gonna be probably building that way but uh, we can go ahead and we can get this cleared out. And we can have a much larger room. This room right here, it's it's big, but it's not large enough. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to work on clearing that out. And actually, you know what? Before we get going any further, we have to see how much Cloutium do we have? We have 477. All right, let's do it. Let's go get ourselves another miner. Get that started up because we got to keep the Cloutium going so we can keep getting more Cloutium, more stuff, more things. It's wonderful. All right, miner. Uh -huh. uh -huh. What? Hold on a second. Are we out of iron? No way. All right, let's grab some iron. I think we're out of iron. Holy moly. I mean, we should have a little bit of iron in here. Um, let's see. How much iron is this? So, <laughs> it's iron. 1.4 million. It's 117,000. Okay. We should be set on the iron. Holy moly, that's a lot of iron. All right, we should be good now. And hit it. Yes. Now, do we have enough for two? Probably not, but we can try our best. Um, I'm going to say we're, we're not going to have enough Cloudium. I mean, we... No, I don't think we're going to have enough Cloudium. We definitely have enough iron, like without a doubt. Can we get a second one? Darn, not a second one. Okay, so let's take this one down. Let's get this one hooked up, and then uh, and then we're gonna start working on our new expansion project, if it were. Can you not open? You can't open the doors while you're holding this. Interesting. All right. So like I said, we're gonna work on this backside here. Let's go ahead and set that there. Let's go flip some switches, turn some things off, and get this bad boy hooked up. So I want to go ahead and turn off all the miners, let the belts finish through. All right, belts are good. Let's go ahead and turn off everything. And let's get some things moved around here. So we're going to move this one out. Is my hammer over there somewhere? I hope it is. It's got to be over here somewhere, right? This is the only side we've been working on. It's not over here. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and uncork that. Oh, hammer. Where did I put it? There it is. Get over here, you hammer. So we need to pull this one out. And then we need to get two elbows. Easy enough. We've done this like a hundred times already. Perfect. Let's go ahead and hammer that in, hammer that in, and then we'll get the two elbows and get this hooked up. Perfect. Okay. All right, that's hooked up. Ready to go. Let's go ahead and hammer those pipes in there. Finalize it. Turn the machine on. And we'll be good. So what I'm thinking is once we have tier three, I think we're going to stop our miners actually right here. So that way, when we do get tier three, we can uh, hopefully just belt it in right here, upgrade that to, or upgrade this guy to tier three, and then have everything run into the same belt um, system. I think that'll be just fine. Let's go ahead and let's put our hammer down out here. And I think we're ready to go. Let's go ahead and turn everything on here. And everything's good. All right, more tier two is mining. Yes, fantastic. All right, so now we're going to start mining out this area here. Um, basically, I want to get 
as much of this mined out as possible. Where's my... That's my bad pick. Where's my good pick? Right here. All right, so I broke through. As you can see, um, however, there is a lot of ground here that we can't clear. So what we're going to have to do is the main level is going to be equal with this one over here. It's going to be just basically straight across that way. We'll go ahead and put some fill dirt in and stuff like that here. Um, and then we'll probably go ahead and make like a little ramp going down into this area for these machines. But um, yeah, we're going to put the floor at this height. So that way, everything for the most part should be good. That might peek out right there a little bit, but I think it'll be okay. Uh, so now I'm trying to work on getting the ceiling done here. And I'm hoping that if I put these lines in here like this, that the uh, the flatten tool will work and we can go ahead and take out a good chunk of the ceiling. Because it's going to have to be, it's going to have to be, I mean, considerably higher than this. Because I don't want it to feel like, you know, we're like trapped in a cave here. I want to be, able, I, it's going to probably have to be like up to here. So we're going to have to go up at least, what, two more, two more sections here. Okay, I've got it cleared out. Oh my gosh, that takes so long. It takes so much longer than I always remember. So I didn't clear this part out yet. Um, I don't know if I'm going to because this part is actually going to go down. So like it's going to be fine. And the edge, I think is probably going to be, I think we're going to bring this door out to like right here. So I think our walls are going to be along this edge right here. And then down here, we're going to bring it down by one and then bring this down by one as well. So I don't think I need to clear all this out as well. And I believe it's high enough now to where we could do a, uh, a wall and a half. Or not. Because um, what I was going to do is a, a wall and a half high and then basically put the ceiling on and then go from there. So basically I need to make sure. Oh, this needs to all go too. Jeez Louise. What am I even doing over here? So basically, I'm actually going to go ahead. I'm going to start stealing some of these just to kind of get like a like a, an idea here of how this is going to work. I don't think I want to use these floors exactly because I'm not sure that I'm a, I'm a big fan of the the stone pattern. I think I might want just like more of like a, a wood floor kind of home feeling thing. Oh, this actually might work perfectly here. Ooh, look at that. It did. It worked perfectly. It covered that up just enough, so it should be good. We should be able to get everything put on this level here. That should line up with these walls as well. But we need to figure out what kind of uh, what kind of floors and walls we're going to want here. You know, uh, Let's go ahead and check our Cloudium. 272. Let's go ahead and get another one. I think we should have at least 30 Cloudium left. Uh, let's go ahead and get this guy made. And another minor tier two put in, and then we will go and I'm going to look at the different types of building structures that we can use. And Claudium is in. Send it. Okay, perfect. Uh, let's go ahead and set that down. Let's throw another one in. See if we have enough. I mean, you know, eventually we're going to have enough extra to uh, to make two of them. Can we make another one? Nope. Still waiting on Claudium. Okay. So let's take this down. We'll get this guy hooked up. Get our Claudium production ramped up even more. And then we're going to go see what building pieces we're going to want to use here. All right. That guy's hooked up. Ready to go. Turn on, turn on, and turn on. <laughs> oh! So we're at one, two, three, four, five, six tier two miners now. Fantastic. And as we're, uh, you know, more tier twos, faster Cloudium. So let's go look at our building structures here. We know we have this type here, which I originally thought would be good for um, for the mine. Because it's like, oh, it's all stone. It looks reinforced. But, uh, you know, it's just a lot of the, it's a lot of repeating pattern, you know. And it feels like a lot, especially if it's going to be like this big. We need something a little, little homier, you know. All right. So let's see what options we have here. We've got, I know we've got one building type over here i think this was like the concrete stuff right oh this is like the uh, little shacks and stuff these are just the standard wood wood wall and concrete floors you know there's something to be said about the concrete floors they're just simple and clean and they look nice but let's go up here because there's a little cottage area up here i think that has um other parts as well now 
the next problem is going to be moving all of these to the mine. That is going to be a... a t oh, I... You know what? I think I like this one better already. I like the walls. What do the floors look like? Hmm. Not actually sure that I like that floor, to be honest. Like, it, it, it almost looks like dirt. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, I do... I do like the house though. The house itself does like actually pretty nice. Cause this is like all, this is a cottage house. So it's a cottage example. I don't know if I like the floor though. I don't know if I like that floor or if I like the, like the regular concrete floor. Um, we do have that starting area and the starting area has some wood floors, but I'm not sure that I, not sure that I, I really liked those either. Hmm. Oh, these have a wood floor. Okay, I like that. I think we're going to go with... I think we're going to go with the wood floor. But then the cottage walls... Yeah, I think I like that. I think we're going to go with the wood floor, but we're, we're going to go with the, the cottage wall stuff. Um, because I like how like nice and clean and bright it looks. I think it's going to make, because I mean, we're always underground. So if we can have a little bit of, a little bit more bright color. And then cottage roof peak. I don't know. Maybe I like the wooden stuff better. Because I mean, like, here's a, here's a wall. Do I like that? So like, I like the, I like the roof, but I wonder how that would look with the cottage walls. You know what? I think we're gonna have to do some mixing and matching here. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to do some mixing and matching here. Now, what I think I'm going to do, since we got everything cleared out, is I think I'm going to explore a mod. Um, I've seen in the comments people have been telling me about a mod that we can use for like uh, bulk storage and bulk buying and stuff like that. So what I might do is I might check out this mod and I think I'm, we might give it a try because if we can buy like a whole bunch of these pieces and not have to take them back in the truck like, you know, two by twos or four by fours, that would save me so much time. Um, but as far as mods go, I think that's like, that's it. Like that's, that's kind of it. I don't want to, I don't want to mod anything else. I just want to try like, you know, the storage, stuff like that. So that way we could buy stuff and maybe just like have it accessible. Yeah, I think that's what we might try. Um, okay. So I kind of have an idea of what I want here. Let's go ahead. Let's head back and let's look at our place. You know what? Let's just pop back in here too. See, I, you know, I originally liked the stone stuff. Actually, I really like these, these piece, these pieces. Huh. I just don't like the interior as much. You know, it's a lot of the same pattern, especially the floor. You know, we could go with the stone walls and the wood floor because the floor is really the thing that I don't, well, you know, I'm, I wasn't a fan of the walls either because it was basically all the same. There was a lot going on, you know, um, we might, we might have to mix and match some parts here. I think that's what we're going to have to do. Yep. We're gonna have to mix and match some parts. And like I said, I think we might try a mod out. I'm gonna go ahead and get that. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can't get that working, get that tried out and see how that goes. Hopefully it goes well. And then in the next episode, we will actually get our house built and hopefully not have to make a thousand trips. But that is gonna end it for this episode. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, basically, I cleared out all of this. Oh my gosh, it took forever. This floor, I just don't, I'm not a fan. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think. What is your favorite pieces? And le let me know why. Not a huge fan of this. I thought I would like this, but this looks more like an exterior kind of thing, you know? Doesn't look like a, a home interior thing, so. Um, but yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like. Maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.